This ancient book is bound together with human skin. We talk about once in a lifetime finds all the time here on Faxbox, so what makes the finding of three books in the Harvard Library so much different? Could it be what was on the inside that made them unusual? It was exactly the opposite. It was what was on the outside that made these three books so incredibly unique. Recently, employees at Harvard Library came across three books that had an unusual feeling. They were slightly smooth and even a little shiny, unlike any leather bound books they'd ever seen before. Come to find out, these three unusual books were bound with skin. Yes, real human skin. Because this seemed absolutely shocking, they decided to do a little bit of research. They found that books bound with skin were actually quite popular in the 17th century. It's called anthropodermic bibliopegy. It was often done on anatomical textbooks. This practice became popular as medical professionals could use the skin of cadavers after they dissected them for research. This was their way of ensuring nothing went to waste. The three books found at the Harvard Library were about Roman poetry, French philosophy, and a treatise on medieval Spanish law. The book Practicarum Questionum Circa Leges Regias also had an inscription inside. The inscription said, The binding of this book is all that remains of my dear friend Jonas Wright, who was flayed alive by the Wamuva on the 4th day of August, 1632. King Mabesa did give me this book, it being one of poor Jonas Chief's possessions, together with ample of his skin to bind it. Requiscat in pace. This book got a lot of attention thanks to that little inscription. So Harvard had it tested. Turns out that the cover was made from cattle and pig collagen. Harvard decided to have all the books tested to see what they were made of. And they did find out that at least one of the books found in their collection was bound with human skin. Harvard Laboratory Director Bill Lane said, The test result from Des Destinies de Lame matched the human reference and clearly eliminated other common parchment sources such as sheep, cattle, and goat. It's believed that there are other human skin bound books out there in the world, but due to some of the negative attention these books received, you might be hard pressed to find the owners willing to admit the ownership of these books. Would you want to read a book bound in human skin? I don't think I would at all. Not only does the inside of this book tell a story, I'm sure there are a lot of stories to be told about the binding of the book as well. Don't forget to share these creepy books bound with skin with your friends. And let us know your thoughts in the comments.